I do wish I remembered what the uh, the original <laughs> title screen music is before you. I don't know if it's when you beat the game or when. I think it's when you beat the game. <laughs> is that it changes to this? Uh, which unfortunately probably did take a little bit away from the impact of uh, the Giselle song. But I mean, I still cried like a baby, and I've played this game before. <laughs> Two of them are just a little bit nonsense words <laughs> for this game. Um, but also, again, I don't know languages very much. So. I do mow the lawn today, so no sniffing.
Yeah, I enjoy singing. I, uh, I do not think I am very good at it, but I enjoy it. I've never been formally or informally trained in it, so it is understandable. You have a nice lurk, Kink. Lurk. Lurk, lurk, lurk. Why didn't it say lurk? Say lurk. L-U-R-K. There we go. What the hell? But yeah, hope you're doing well, Cake. Well. Had to go outside and touch grass. Rip. Terrible. Captions as being a little funky today. Everybody, has everybody seen the new Pokemon trailer for uh, Scarlet and Violet? <laughs> they literally just look like two of the Pokemon just look like Mega Man Battle Network characters. It's great. <laughs> uh, like the Net Navis. the title shows the title says we have Jacopo left have Jacopo left to him That's right, I don't think we went too far last time. We didn't really play too much last time. We were still in... Or did we... I think we just finished his story. Yeah. I'm gonna call him Yukimasa, even though he says he has no name. But everyone else seems to have their names. So it seems. Well, I think someone said that uh, the Lord's name is Francois Bonnier, which uh, is too fancy a name for Jacopo. He's a punk ass bitch. Guess we will see if he can live up to that name in this in this timeline. <laughs> timeline. This in this time? I don't know. I don't know. Hmm. Uh, I think I liked it. Hold on, I'm, I'm rearranging some stuff. I think I liked it better that way. I'm gonna close that. I'm doing some some spring cleaning on my desk desktop. <laughs> everything.
appalling, is it not? Morgana. If you hate me for what I did to her, you can take the sword and kill me with it. What a drama queen. And you can have my key. I won't put up a fight. I don't... Yukimasa, not everyone is good is as good at killing as you are. We'd fuck it up. Like... The only thing worse than someone who's good at killing trying to kill you is someone who's bad at killing trying to kill you. Because <laughs> they'll miss, they'll hit non-vitals on their way to trying to kill you and it'll... They'll prolong it. They'll just make it hurt like a bitch. I I have literally no like what's the word I'm looking for? Evidence to back this up. Just what I think. Have the right to exact punishment on me. Uh, yeah, he does think of us as an angel, doesn't he? I mean, to be fair, I, I was trying to like bring up the character things from uh, You Mean Echo, but this game doesn't have those, which is fine. I just do, I do kind of miss it. I do have a backlog, which is very nice. I don't think. I think it's only during the fake fourth door that there is fucking with the backlog. Killing you would accomplish nothing. It is neither my place to forgive nor punish you. That is Morgana's. Is that what he's gonna say? As much as it would make me feel better, doing so would serve no meaningful purpose. cool down enough that I can talk to you with a clear head. We do still have a, 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 a shoulder wound and all our fingers broken on an arm, so or on a hand, so uh, it would be difficult I think. Of course. <sighs> He's like, sorry I broke your fingers. My bad guy. <laughs> So awkward. <sighs> so you are still willing to speak with me? I gave you my word. Hi, Alice. How are you? Eh, I'm stretching. Ooh, ooh, ooh. How was your day? <laughs> told you I would help uh, figure out what path you should take. You're an 
honorable man. Also quite a high pain tolerance, apparently. I know I'd be crying like a bitch at this point. And probably far before this point. force your hand if you don't want to do this. Funny thing about that, uh, you kind of did force my hand in a way <laughs> by breaking all the fingers on one of them. Not, not great. You can tell me to leave and I'll walk right out the door. More than anger or hatred. I'm uh, simply deeply pained. Like, physically? Maybe things would have turned out better if I were as sympathetic a man as you. People are supposed to feel happy or sad for each other. I can't, though, which must make me a beast. That's just a uh, low empathy, which I get. It's like that. That's a that's a common autism thing. I get it. That doesn't make you a beast. Killing people and and and, and torturing them kinda does. You know, enjoying it is is weird, but like. That should be a non-factor. Just don't, just don't do it. Just don't. Also, God, he has such a weird haircut. I don't know. When you first met Morgana, you felt a desire to rescue her from the slave traders. Did you not? You thought of someone other than yourself. I never saw that desire through, though. I mean, you you killed the slave traders. And you, you also did kill the slaves after, but you didn't kill Morgana. At least you just traumatized her. A lot. far overpowered anything I may have wanted to do for her. It's a zucchini, it's a me, Mario. How are you, V? How you doing? V. There you go. Oh, buddy. <laughs> Welcome. I, have you seen me play this game before? Were you here? It's been a while since I played it. It's... Rice Krispies? Fuck yeah. <laughs> no, let me swear, captions. Fuck. Thank you. Fuck with a PH? What? What is that even? <laughs> Whatever. Whatever. Captions is weird. But yeah, that's nice. That's good. But yeah, this man is, uh... Bit of a psychopath? Music is louder than me, thank you. Um, uh, let me turn myself up here. There we go, is that a little bit better? I also was kind of far from the mic. Would you believe it that even, even after, how long have I been streaming? It's probably been almost, it's probably been over, well no, no. I don't know how long it's been. 
But yeah, I'm doing good. Uh, I, I touched grass. I mowed the lawn. Uh, now I'm sore. But twas good to do. How about you, V? How are you doing? And Alice won't respond to me. Alice is so mean. I asked her how she's doing, and she won't respond. I can't believe it. And the next time we met, I sold her to the Lord. Yeah, you also did cut off her arm. It's a pretty important. Oh, oof. I'm sorry that you had a bad pain day, but hopefully, uh, hopefully the other two things helped counteract that. What vid what video games will you play in, if you don't mind me asking? Hopefully not League. <laughs> that would just lead to more pain. Oh no, not League. Terrible. Uh. Did you see the new, um, that's fair. Did you see the new, what are they? The, the Fright Night, I think is what they're called. Uh, skins, they look really cool. They're like the new Halloween skins. They look neat. Oh yeah. Yeah, it feels better. Well, I mean, yeah, now she actually has a skin I might want. <laughs> Maybe I'd actually play her at some point. She just feels weird. She's so, I don't know. She just feels very low range compared to other, I don't know. I'm also just bad. <laughs> yeah, what was it? There's a... Uh... Renata is very interesting. Oh my god. I remember playing against a, uh, a Renata and a, a Fed Olaf, and oh my god. That was... <laughs> oh. Oh man. That is, that is a terrifying combo. Olaf wants to get low and uh, beat you to death when he's at low health. And then uh, Renata just... Gives him more attack speed, more move speed, and uh, makes it so even if he does die, he doesn't, you know, die. Nice. Nice, nice. I haven't been playing League as much because I know that when I do play League, that's kind of the only game I play for the rest of the day. <laughs> uh, yeah, I get sucked in too easily. And I do want to stream at some points. <laughs> and I do not believe my computer can currently stream League. Uh, I mean, you've seen how it reacts with just Discord. Oh, yeah, yeah. But yeah, congrats on the Mastery 6. I... I don't think I even have, like... Level 3 on it. <laughs> uh... I should probably play her more. I don't know. Okie dokes. Yeah, we'll see. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna go for probably like three-ish hours. And I was thinking, yeah, I wanna... I would, that would be fun. Yeah, yeah. Are you... Uh, did you get all of your... Uh, <laughs> all of your um, challenges? <laughs> Did your ARAM arc come to an end? <laughs> ah, rip. Good luck. Yeah, this man is Yukimasa. He is... Kinda hot, but also... Boy, what what is that hairstyle? I don't, I don't like it. Um, also, he... Is a psychopath. And... Uh, broke all of the fingers on one of our uh, hands and stabbed us in the shoulder with his katana. But, but now he's cool. 
now now we 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 uh we convinced him to to join our side yeah yep so uh he is hold on actually i almost forgot to do this ba -ba 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 -ba. so uh all of hold on let me see if i can da 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 that is all him that that's that's like all of this that's his stuff that's almost entirely him <laughs> um i guess there's there's torture that happens that isn't him but the murder, the stabbing, the cutting people open, the beheading, the breaking bones, the cannibalism. The cannibalism. <laughs> but yeah, Alice, I mean, you didn't even say you didn't even say how you were doing. So I don't know. You you didn't even tell me how your day was. Oh, you got a new game. Nice, nice. What is it? I, you know, somehow I knew that. I, I think I heard it somewhere. Against my will. Not a fan, you know. Not a fan of that knowledge, but I know it now, and I can't unknow it. So it's just a uh, Disney version of Animal Crossing. Interesting. Interesting. Very interesting. Yep, I know, Alice. How could you? Why do you hate V so much? And me. <laughs> Thank you, captions. You just so much hate. Lies, so many lies, Alice. When do the lies stop? So much hate. Hate. Let me tell you how much I have come to hate. Oh, I don't remember the, uh, I don't remember the entire monologue. That's about it. But yeah, I'm, I hope you're having fun with the, uh, with the. Uh, Animal Crossing Disney version. But yeah, this man also uh, aided in the kidnapping of a young girl um, and cut off her arm. Uh, and helped to siphon blood from her to sell as a miracle cure. This game is interesting. So we are trying, we are currently trying to save that girl's soul because she is there's so much in this game <laughs> so basically there is this character and then there's two other guys that um the girl who's named morgana uh blames for understandably so for locking her up in a tower and betraying her and uh siphoning her of her blood and uh letting her die so she hated them so much that she became like a, a witch or something like a ghost essentially but um she made a wish to govern over their like next lives to make them absolute hell for them and she wants to do that for all eternity 
So she wants to watch these guys reincarnate and fuck up their lives uh, again and again and again. So uh, we're trying to... We're trying to get their their sides of the story. So uh, maybe she, you know, doesn't do that for all of eternity? And also, uh, you know, we the main character are a trans guy, which is really cool. Uh, and there's a really sweet love story with him and another, and a woman. It's really nice. I was gonna say another character. But yeah, anyways. <laughs> that is my attempt at a recap. Uh, it's... There's so much that goes on in this game. As I said before, there is no room for interpretation in the things I have done. Whatever I might have wanted to do at one point, it's all meaningless now. Yeah, um, I would... If you'd like visual novels, which I understand are not everyone's cup of tea, I would highly recommend this game. I, even though I did kind of just spoil anything, everything, I apologize. Um, but it is a very good game. Uh... It is probably the best visual novel I know, and one of my faves. It's, it's very good. And, uh, the art style, the music, the everything is mwah, chef's kiss. Regardless, anything I do for someone is ultimately, someone else is ultimately for my own benefit. Oh, hold on. Because it's what I need. Also, this is our main character. Yes, he looks like a vampire. It's great. He has zero social skills. It's fantastic. To be fair, he was stuck in a mansion for... 10 years? I'm trying to remember the timeline. So he was stuck in one mansion, and then he had to leave that mansion because his dad wanted him killed. Uh, and then he went to another mansion where he just lived on his own. There's too much. There's so much. It's a very good game, though. And it, it goes on sale pretty often, I think. Um, and I know I am so, so excited because the people behind this game are working on a new game, which is like, uh, I think it's like a detective game or something, a detective visual novel, which I am excited for. <laughs> no matter how selfish your motivations may ultimately be. Please, let me believe some part of you does genuinely want to help her. Oh, fair enough. Fair enough. I don't think I've actually played one of those on stream. I know I've played I've played plenty of those off. Well, I don't know plenty. I've played Katawa Shoujo. Uh, the Fruit of Grisaya. Um, oh, I can't remember. Hato Fool Boyfriend. <laughs> Do you know what Hato Fool Boyfriend is? Hato Fool. Oh. I have been meaning to play um, a game called You Do Indeedy. Oh, Hato Fool Boyfriend is fantastic. I have been meaning to play a game called Lady Killer in a Bind, which I I don't think it's to you have a cat dating sim? Oh, that's fantastic. I don't think Lady Killer in a Bind is too risky for Twitch. Cause there is a tag for it. There's like a, a, a there's a whatever you want to call it, but uh Let's see, what is the description for Lady Killer in a Bind? Give me one second. I know I'm I know I'm rambling a lot, but uh that's what I do. <laughs> the full title Oh perfect date. Oh my god. 
The full title is My Twin Brother Made Me Cross-Dress As Him, and now I have to deal with a geeky stalker and a dom beauty who want me in a bind. It is described as an erotic romantic comedy about social manipulation, cross-dressing, and girls tying up other girls. Very good. A very good uh, description there. <laughs> Come on, coward. Let's see. I'm trying to think. I don't think I've actually played a dating sim on stream, have I? Oh, I did play. Well, I played a game that's an anti dating sim. <laughs> called I just want to be single uh, but that's the demo for it uh, you coward how could you be don't think I've played too many uh, NSFW dating sims don't don't think so So unfortunately, I don't think I have any recommendations on that regard for you. <laughs> A text-based RPG that's like full-on and it's interesting. What is that? Not, not involved. Ahem. <clears throat> Are you even able to say it? <laughs> I may or may not have heard of it because don't ignore that. Interesting. Interesting. I Nobody clip this. I have indeed heard and played that. And the sequel. And the space one. Anyways. Anyways, um you don't like the space one? I don't know. That. Eh. I liked it, but it's also like. It, it, for what reason exactly? I think I played the space one the most because that was the one I could get to like work on my phone. <laughs> Oh. oh boy. I don't know if that one's like a dating sim. That's that's a that's a meet and fuck game <laughs> uh, in text form. Oh, uh, I mean, I guess there, there, there's dating. Any, mm. you know what? It's at this point. It's at, at time like times like these. I'm glad, you know. My channel is not any bigger. <laughs> yeah, that makes sense. Yeah, I 
You could say I know of it. Anyways, <laughs> uh, this game is definitely not a dating sim, and, um, and it's it's a it's a linear visual novel, which they're cool, but. You know, it is also nice to have like multiple endings and well, I say a linear visual novel. There's there are endings of sorts, but they're bad endings <laughs> where it just ends. It's just the story just stops there until you go back and make the right choice. So endings, quote unquote. I'm trying to. <laughs> played Aviary Attorney. That game was actually really good. I really enjoyed that one. Just looking through all of my, uh... That's a toughie, isn't it? I don't I don't really have that many of those actually either. <laughs> different subfolders and <laughs> the gigabytes of visual novel I think I like more like uh, mystery visual novels like I'm playing Yumi Neko right now as well well not right now our life i don't know if i've heard of that one and the actual the well you do what you would count that right yeah 999 is definitely a visual novel oh is that that is that the one i think interesting i think maybe i know of that but yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm more of a mystery nerd. <laughs> but interesting, maybe I'll have to take a look. I have also been meaning to play at some point uh, Monster Prom on stream. I haven't, I've played a little bit of it, but I don't think I ever gotten any of like the good endings. I am just terrible at that. <laughs> I'm, have you heard of Monster Prom uh, V? That one's fun. I hear they're working on like a third one recently or something like that. Freaking roguelike dating sim. <laughs> uh, what, a, what a weird concept. I love it. I know I'll sound like a hypocrite for saying this. Yeah, uh, me too. Yeah, I just played it by myself like a loser. <laughs> uh, maybe we'll have to do that at some point. Uh. Although I don't... <laughs> I really, really need to get that new PC, but it's just... Uh. 
Uh, don't want to think about that too much. It stresses me out just thinking about it. <laughs> but yeah, that. Uh, and then there's what is there? There's Monster Prom. There's Monster Camp. And then there's like Monster Road Trip, I think. But I don't think that's like the third one. I think that's like a, a DLC for one of them or something. I don't know. All I know is they're fun. I watched um. I watched Ollie from Hollow Live play uh play that recently. That was a that was a very interesting <laughs> uh She makes me look look tame by comparison. The amount of times she was talking about demon dick. Oh man. No no yeah, there you go. Say demon dick, you coward. Let me let me say demon dick. But yeah, that game looks really fun. That would be like a that that would definitely be like a fun collab game. If I ever do actually collab with anybody. <laughs> uh. But sitting back and waiting for her to die is not what I want. Yeah, that didn't really work out for you well in the original timeline. There's also time travel, maybe, in this game? <laughs> We are, we are like, somehow self-inserted into Morgana's time? Or maybe just her memories or something? It's weird. But we are, we're not sure, quite sure what it is. But, uh, we are trying to save her life before... We're trying to save her in three days before she dies, uh, during the Harvest Festival, and, uh, everything goes to shit. Good, good, good. You know, cutting off arms usually doesn't feel good. When I cut off her arm, I didn't feel any of the thrill or euphoria that I usually do when I take my sword to someone. I can't say whether that means I had a conscience, if but for a moment, or I just wasn't myself at the time. If you can save her, though, Please do. Also, I will be, I will be truthful about the reason. Because, you know, I don't want to go for too long because I still... I haven't been able to do as long of streams for a while. Maybe I'll try to do some more. But I, it's just tough for me to, like, take a break and then come back to it, I guess. I don't know. But also, uh... <laughs> There's, there's a stream I want to watch that's happening at 10, which is three hours from now. <laughs> if I'm ever late for a stream, or if I'm ever... If I ever wrap it up suddenly, that's probably the reason. <laughs> uh, oh, I'm... I'm, uh, I'm too much of a shrimp for others. Did you know there's a follow limit on uh on Twitch? <laughs> I have hit it multiple times. Cuz I'll I'll follow and then I'll have to go back and I'll 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 hit the limit and I'll have to go and like unfollow like some people that I'm like, "Oh, I I never watched them." Yeah, yeah, streaming, streaming can be rough. I uh did I I I don't know if you know um <laughs> So, I decided, uh, this was a while ago, um, that I wanted to do a single stream of Mega Man Battle Network 3, uh, where I played through the entire game in one stream, and I was like, I know this game pretty well, I'm sure it won't take that long, like, you know, 8-10 hours at max? It took me 21 hours. Twenty-one. Oh, that stream was a... <laughs> that stream was... 
It was a lot of fun, but also, oh my god. <laughs> I remember about hour 11 in, I started going a little bit insane, and I think for about, for about half an hour, I just started singing, and I didn't say anything. <laughs> oh. Don't, don't do what I did, and, and jump immediately into that. Because the, the longest stream I'd done before then was like eight hours. <laughs> oh, that was not a good... Yeah. <laughs> yeah, see, see, I was not thinking. That is the thing. Oh, uh, and then... Oh, of art. Wow, jeez. Oh, yeah, yay. Yeah, oh, man. That'll, that, that won't help with that, I'm sure. Oof. But I'm sure the art was nice. <laughs> yeah, can't do those too often. <laughs> That's the kind of stream you really have to plan for. Although, I mean, there's freaking. I don't think. I think Corona uh, from. Uh, you, the dog girl from Hollow Live. She hasn't been doing, like, insane streams. <laughs> like, I remember, um, like, right when I was first getting into VTubers, um, I think I saw her playing Assassin's Creed. And. Um, I think it went on for like 30 hours and <laughs> what she's insane oh yeah yeah could uh, yeah, just oh and I think that was one of her shorter you know longer streams insane dog too powerful I can't do anything what bro you've got a katana you've got well i guess we are trying to get the lord's key without killing him unfortunately as the title suggests i am not a fan of the lord his name is jacopo he's an asshole but uh we'll we'll we'll, we'll meet him soon enough if I try, I'll only make things worse. Did I ask you? I don't know. I, uh, see now I've forgotten. Because I can't remember anything. <laughs> I, uh, mm, did I? I, uh, I don't think so. But I also don't remember. Two bad bitches with a uh, terrible memory right here. Oh yeah, yeah. Can't remember what I said two seconds ago. To be fair, yeah, you kind of you kind of only know how to torture and uh, kill people with a sword. You know, kind of kind of limits your career path and. Ah, uh, okay. Well, that's nice. Just chilling. Chilling, playing League. Not raging. Which is good. <laughs> Zoe players be like... <laughs> I don't know. Is it? Are you in ARAM or is it? I mean, it doesn't really. It doesn't matter. No matter what, just people get mad. No matter what. Definitely. I. I yeah. ARAM. Ugh. Why do people get mad in ARAM of all places? Like I kind of get it. It's like, uh, in like ranked maybe, but like also don't be an asshole in ranked. Which, oh my god. Oh. 
Uh, God, people always are like, the it's the worst thing in the world when sur supports take kills, and it's like... Buddy, just do more damage. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. But yeah, another mission done. Congrats. <laughs> I don't know. People, uh... If the support taking the kill is, like, the deciding factor in the game, it was not. <laughs> there were m many other things more important that decided that game. Like... Don't baby rage about that. There there was definitely more you could have... It, I don't know. It's just... People. People. Uh, people. People be like that. Da -da. I cannot do everything on my own either. Yep. And that's also something that, uh... That people gotta get through their heads in League as well. It's not a single player game. Surprise, surprise! Ay, ay, ay. Do -do 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 -do. Oh, were they pinging everybody else, too? Uh. Listen, spam pinging is only good when it's when it's funny, when you're doing it to your friend as a joke. That's the only good. That's the only good thing for spam pinging. And you know, spamming a terrible emote, like the, uh, <laughs> like the Shivana emote. <laughs> uh, uh, that emote is. That emote is something. You've you've converted me. I I have I I've. I can't stop using that emote now. You've converted me to the Shivana. Uh, question mark emote or whatever. It's terrible. Yep. <laughs> it's so... Oh. It's... It, that is free. You, you know what? That's true. I'm just happy I have the ooh, ooh emote. Uh, that one's great. <laughs> I mean, the best emote, hands down, is the is the default thumbs up. That is... I mean, you can't beat that one. That, that's a classic. Give me your word that you will atone to Morgana for your actions. Well, I doubt making reparations will clear me of my crimes. If that is what you want me to do, that is what I will do. Can I ask you something? So... So yeah, this could... So this is like... It's weird, because it's... We're in the, like, medieval times, but then this guy gets, like, reincarnated in... I guess it's technically, like, reconstituted, because he's made... He's the same person again. Um... In, like... 1500s, 1600s, I think? This game is... This game is wild. <laughs> this game is wild. <laughs> <laughs> uh, can I ask you something? What is it? Tell me more about my next life. Oh boy, it's... Uh, you go off the deep end. You kill your girlfriend on accident. Uh, you kill everyone in the village. It's bad. It's not good. Let's let's see how let's see how Michael puts it. 
I want to know what kind of man I am. I want to know every mistake I make. All the details. I don't think you want to know all the details. I warn you, it's a tale far more barbaric than anything you can imagine. That is fair. Do you still want to hear it? I do. And I have little doubt that I will believe it. If you're worried I might react the way I did earlier, I'll lay down my sword. Yeah, you know, don't stab us again, please. You can tie me up too if you want. No, I... Not into that. No, thank you. I'd rather be the one tied up. I mean, what? Anyways. That won't be necessary. I'm going to trust you. I'll tell you the whole hopelessly tragic truth. Everything I saw with no embellishments. Please do. Oh, is it, it's just gonna fade to black and it's like, yeah, okay. And so I told him the tale I witnessed beyond the second door. That he lost his memory in a shipwreck. That he was treated like a beast by the people in the land where he washed up. That he massacred countless people. And that he took the life of his lover who had come in search of him. Never wavering in her belief that he was still alive. That one really hurt. That one really fucking hurt. Pauline deserved better, man. Oh, that one hurt. Told him about the white-haired girl. Told him about the things he made Giselle do. I didn't hide anything. As I spoke, he would occasionally grimace, or his eyes would go wide for a moment. But not once did he interrupt me. He sat there in silence until I finished. Yeah, me too, bud. <laughs> oh my god. Woo! You weren't kidding. That was far worse than I had imagined. It is the truth, though. Uh, what is my voice doing? <laughs> you become the target of Morgana's loathing, and you are led back to this mansion. That is what lies in your future. Uh, as difficult as it may be to comprehend, that person is you. The man who does all those things hundreds of years from now is you. I really am a beast. A horrendously precarious creature. As I interpret it, when you lost your memory, you also lost everything you used to suppress your nature. Your tether. That's what he calls his... the people that he can rely on to help suppress his darkest urges. You lost the foundation you had built, and as a result, you were no longer to main, able to maintain that balance. Would that mean what I am now is, comparatively speaking, human? Uh, yeah. No, I'm no different now. I have no more control over myself when I'm killing people than the man you described. Uh, you did stop killing us. I mean, that's because... Your nun lover came in, but you did stop, and you didn't kill her this time. Yay. 
progress? Reserve, re 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 reverse progress. Because this is before that. things and in spite of that you were never condescending Con condescending condescending sorry <laughs> or insulting never acted disgusted or afraid of me I would be afraid I would be afraid like kudos to Michael I'd, I'd piss my fucking pants if I saw what this man did Jesus. Are all angels as compassionate as you? Uh, how... <sighs> I am not an angel. I was simply biting my tongue. Are you afraid of me then? I am not afraid of you, no. Uh, what are you then? I don't understand. I am of the belief that now is not the appropriate time for me to allow my personal feelings to influence my manner, my actions. I'm a trans guy. I Listen, I went through puberty twice, okay? Nothing can scare me. <laughs> Is that, that's what Michael's saying. I personally am not a trans guy, but Michael is. Trans and intersex, which is very cool. And from what I hear, they portray it very well. My task is to save Morgana. If I'm to be honest with you for a moment, I despise the man you are in the future. That is fair. Probably because of... But I'm also equally frustrated at myself. You know, because of what he did, and also because of what what he made Giselle do, because he made our he made our GF cook people into a into food. Yikes. Get him into a big stew. Oh. Oh shit. For anybody keeping up with the, um... Does anybody here use Twitter? I hope you don't. But if you do, is anybody here keeping up with the, um... The, the rage and... How do you say his name? From Mob Psycho. Um... His... Tournament winning arc on on t on Twitter where he is he has won both the what's Twitter exactly hi Kev how are you um anyways he has won both the poll for the anime twink of all time and the anime dilf of all time and now he is going for the tumblr sexy man and also i believe he's in the milf category as well and and if you know this man he lo he he looks like middle-aged germa <laughs> it's well i mean i guess germa is middle-aged but like more so in a suit he's, he's like this greasy con man that like for some reason the the animators of mob psycho got like decided to make him like they, they just got really horny for his animations and he anyways <laughs> there's a lot but i'm doing good anyways another tangent i'm doing good uh how are you doing kev 
And yeah, that's understandable. I mean, to be fair, Twitter has good porn sometimes. So that's, you know, that's enough of a reason. No, not poem. Let me say porn. There you go. Thank you. I will be as degenerate. Let me, let me wallow in my degeneracy. But yeah, um, we are still talking with the swordsman, Yukimasa, because, uh, I have gone off on so many different tangents. <laughs> Oh yeah. Oh good. I'm glad your eyes are slowly getting better. How are your how are your hands doing? And yeah, Calc is ugh. Oy, oy, oy. I think I made it through Calc. But I, I I'm okay at math. At least stat stats is what kicked my ass. Oh my god. Statistics? Ugh. No thank you. No, thank you. You're right. The things you did works uh, inexcusable. Yeah. So we're talking about uh, what Yukimasa does in the future, which is bad. <laughs> he does a lot of bad. He does a lot of... He does a lot. Door number two, baby. It is like... Half of all the content warnings. <laughs> Door number two is like, comprises half of the content warnings for this game. Oh. Uh, you murdered innocents. You killed the woman who came searching for you. But on a personal level. Yeah, I thought so. I mean, Michael is a good person, but I mean, he's still selfish, which is fine. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. Oof. Yeah. Yeah, writing will do that. Oy, oy, oy. Is there anything you're able to type up, or is it like you have to turn it in, like, handwritten homework or something like that? Hate that. But on a personal level, what angers me the most is that you put blood on the hands of the woman I love. Oh. Uh, I, I mean, I'm, I, I would hope that if you talked with them, they'd be like, okay, sure. But also, college professors do be like that sometimes. I think I... I, I I think it was like an entirely unrelated podcast or something. I think it was like a podcast about Shin Megami Tensei for some reason. Um, but they talked about how they heard something. Somebody was talking about how like college professors, they're like a lot of them are just like professors because they have to be because they like they, they come to the university and they do like research or whatever. And then they have, like, a, a mandated, like, amount of classes they have to teach. <laughs> so it's, like, it's not... I don't know. That's a weird system. I don't know. The plus side, I mean, there are, you know... It, well, it means teachers don't care as much. It also means teachers don't care as much. So <laughs> they can be a lot more lax sometimes. Sometimes, not so much. It just depends on the teacher, unfortunately. I know very well that, to you, it's something you haven't done yet. But it was still your soul. It tears me apart inside that I couldn't return in time to stop it. You'd be hard pressed to find anyone who wouldn't be angry to know that someone they cared, they care about, had received that kind of treatment. I suppose. 
If that's how you feel, though, aren't you interested in taking revenge on me? As I mentioned before, there are times when allowing your emotions to take the reins is the wrong course of action. This is one of those times. But I also, I also know that <laughs> as someone who is horrendous at talking to, like, well, people in general, but also to, like, ask for help, I know that is a very, very difficult thing to do. Like, oh my god. I am so bad at that. <laughs> uh, I think I'm a little better, because... God, I, I ran my, I, burnout fucking killed me in, in college, and, uh, I, uh, I had to take a break for a while, and it's still, it's still, uh, but, asking for help is, <laughs> honestly, just so difficult, uh, such a such a tough thing to do. Seeking vengeance is the wrong thing for me to do now. Is he gonna become the Batman? I, I, his parents aren't. Well, his parents are. You know, dead of natural causes. And dead to him. Because, oh my god, his parents are such assholes. If I can eliminate Morgana's hatred, the three of your souls will be set for you as well. Are there any good parents? I, there's... There's Giselle's mom. Um... There's, there's the, the grandpa that teaches uh, Giselle how to be a maid. Um, that acts like a father for father figure for her for a little bit. Um, I think that's the <laughs> I think that's the limit of good good parental figures. Well, and there's Michael and Giselle who are, you know. Well, they don't really have a kid yet, but they could definitely be good parents, I think. So, you're going to save me too? Uh, yes, I am. I don't consider myself worthy of redemption. Oh, boo-hoo. Suck it up, you're gonna... Fuck you, you're gonna you, You're gonna you're gonna get redeemed and you're gonna like it, alright? I'm the protagonist, I say so. <laughs> Maybe not redeemed, redeemed, but you're gonna you're gonna get stuck. You're stuck with me. <laughs> Especially not after about hearing about the things I will do. I'm a beast through and through. A twisted, psychopathic monster. Why did it spell twisted like that? You were conflicted, though. You struggled against the creature that dwelled inside of you. Does... Every time I see this, I think it's a little hair. I hate it. It's true you found perverted joy and violence and murder but you also felt kindness which caused a part of you to seek peace and the same of can be the same can be said of you in this time as well if you actually were nothing but a beast or rather nothing but a man that derived pleasure in killing maybe then I could have truly reviled you that's the tough thing, you know. Nobody's ever 100% evil or 100% good. It's just... Just human. Ah. 
how humans be. What did I what did I point out? Oh yeah. <laughs> the hair. Sorry. <laughs> oh, I didn't mean to. Then you would be irredeemable, no matter what had turned you into that. No matter how much pain and suffering had driven you to that point. But your instability, your constantly shifting desires, your mental frailty, all appear to me as very human traits. Tell me, how should I live my life from here on? What is it you want most? I... Uh, the easiest road for me would be the one I walk now, to continue being a killer. No fighting my desires, no resisting what's inside of me. Would that be my salvation? To abandon my humanity entirely? I don't know what I should do, what I'm supposed to do. I'm at a complete loss about everything. I would like to believe that your desire to live in peace is sincere. And that's what I want for you too. It will be the more trying path, yes. Because you will have to fight against your nature to stay on it. But we live in the human world. And you also have Pauline, who wants the same thing. Extending her hand for you. Inviting you to join her. Just don't kill her again, please. I don't think I could take that. Uh, I don't think I could take a redo of... I don't think door two... Uh, door two was rough, man. Oh my god. That door was pain from start to finish. I, I guess there was glimpses whenever we whenever we switched over to Pauline, there were there were small snippets of niceness, kind moments. Which only served to make it worse when Yukimasa killed her. <laughs> oh man. Chapters are. Ay, ay, ay. So, I encourage you to suppress your urges. Your life will not be easy for it, but I implore you to take the rocky road for your own sake and for hers. Oh, Kev, are you. Uh, have you been keeping up with, like, the new Pokemon stuff? I don't know if you're interested in that. I don't remember if you are. I apologize. But uh, the new pokes look cool. Even if it means my entire life is built on a foundation of lies? Before today, I believed it was wrong not to be true to oneself. But as I listened to you tell your tale, I came to realize that maybe there are exceptions. Some things you can, and possibly should, keep locked inside you, where they can't hurt anyone else. However, I also think you have a tendency to try and act too perfect around her, both in this life and the next. You cover up so much of yourself, you become an entirely different person. You can be your conflicted, imperfect self around her. The man you are right now, lost and trying to find his way. Hi, Jess! How are you? Uh, oh, I'm happy to see you. Oh, okay, yeah, that is fair. It's It's been a lot. I'm doing good. 
We are, uh... I have gone off on so many, so many tangents. We're like an hour and a half in, and, uh... Can I... Hold on. I, I can literally scroll back to where we started. That's where we started today. <laughs> and... That's where we are now. <laughs> we, it's, uh, it's been slow going, but... I'm having fun. I have little doubt she will accept that man. What you need most is restraint. Perhaps a pair of handcuffs. Pauline might be into that. Or, you know, maybe she'd be into you wearing them. Anyways, ignore that I said that. Yeah, but we also have been going for an hour and a half. It's been a while. Thank you, butt spot. So true. I read that butt. Don't worry about it. I see. So tell me, do you think my future can be changed? I don't know for certain, so all I can do is speculate. But as you share the same soul, Expect any changes you make now will be reflected in your future incarnation. I have my work cut out for me then. That's for sure. Pauline, she believed in me. She put her faith in a beast and went out to in search of him. I cannot allow myself to be the kind of monster that would murder a woman like her. I have to change. I will change the future. Change the future. What is it? Change the future. My final message. Goodbye. can do it. When my life here comes to an end, I vow to make my next one better. Thank you for listening to me and for giving me guidance. Uh, I can't say I'm particularly suited for the job. Yeah, poor Michael. He's, he's gets thrown in here and has to, has to talk to people. Ugh. He's too relatable. He doesn't want to do any of that. Knowing that my words are going to influence the direction of another's life is an unimaginable amount of pressure. Don't worry, that's... that's everyday life! You never know what, what, what random thing you say could change somebody's life forever! Haha! -ha. Yay! Wahoo! Love that. I don't know. I say you pull it well, uh, off well enough. Yeah, exactly. Uh, socially active? No thanks. Physically active? No thanks as well. If you ever decide, <laughs> decide to quit being an angel, you'd make a damned convincing missionary. I have no interest in being a missionary. And as I've told you, I'm not an angel. I only want the missionary position. I mean, what? That's too bad. I'd join the church of Michael. <sighs> Don't look at me like that. I'm just kidding. Now can I get angry at you? <laughs> as I've been telling you, I'm an ordinary man. I'm not special in any way, like you seem to think I am. You're 
not ordinary. You're different, but not in the same way I am. I'm... I wouldn't ask any normal man to show me how to lead my life. I see. Although, what passes for normal differs from person to person, I suppose. Just as I don't think you're normal, I'm sure there are people out there who do. Perhaps. You know Michael's thinking of Giselle right there. <laughs> oh. Maybe they're just able to see my desire to be normal. Well, that's everything I have to tell you. You're going to want to talk to the Lord next, I assume. We have been in this room for an hour and a half. We have to leave. That's right. I'm going to convince him to hand over his key, and then I'm going to set Morgana free. I doubt you'll have much luck convincing him of anything, but I'll help in any way I can. I appreciate it. I'll get him to come to supper tonight. You be there too. Okay, I'll be there. Oh man, we we had the... And I thought the last time we went out for supper was the most awkward time. This is going to be even worse. Because last time it was Mel and Michael and, and this guy. And, and now it's going to be three of them and freaking Jacopo. Jacopo. What did it try to say there? Captions. All right. If I could ask you one favor, though. Could you try to arrange that for as late as possible? That should be doable. But why? There's someone else I need to speak with first. All right. I'll do what I can. Thank you. Who is it that... Is it... Is it Maria? I think she already bounced, didn't she? See you this evening, then. Or are we going to try to contact Giselle again? Because we haven't been able to hear from her. Hmm. Did I lead him to the correct path? Will he actually find redemption at the end of it? No, I made the right decision. Even if he doesn't in this life, there's enough of a chance that he will in the next. That's it. I'm almost there, Giselle. I've almost made it to Morgana. I've come this far. All that's left is to speak with the Lord. Stay focused, Michael. The pieces I have still don't fit together yet. As Morgana told him, the Lord was a cruel man from the moment she first saw him. He wasn't much different in the swordsman telling, swordsman's telling of events either. Are those portrayals the full picture of what kind of a man he is? Well, I mean, he was he was an asshole in his own. You know, locking his wife in a shed and abusing her is not. You know, not the greatest. Mm -hmm. 
Will adding his perspective do anything but amplify Morgana's hatred? If he really is exactly the man he's been in, made out to be, how do you explain his internal struggles from the third door? Did his core personality change with the times? Everyone else I've met has been fundamentally the same, though. Are you the exception? Jacopo? <sighs> Morgana found joy in her life during her three years at the brothel. She wept about not being given the opportunity to thank them. So maybe Maria's more likely to be able to assuage Morgana's animosity. I'll have to hear what she has to say. Oh, oh, that's right. She did say she wanted to meet later to talk about Morgana's time at, um... The brothel. Pass out, bud. I can barely move my right arm. Oh yeah, uh, we did ba have that still happening. We we did still we did get stabbed, and all our fingers broken. feel my fingers at all it burns yeah michael's had it rough as <sighs> as a lot he he, he he has it rough a lot <laughs> poor guy oh man Manage this long, but damned if it doesn't hurt. <laughs> yeah, uh, Yukimasa tortured us. Um, he kidnapped us and then tortured us, uh, broke all our fingers on one of our hands, and stabbed us with his katana in the shoulder. Or maybe not stabbed is the right word. He sliced. He was gonna. He was gonna slice off our arm i think but uh pauline and mel saved the day mel of all people saved the day <laughs> oh are we passing the fuck out yep goodbye <laughs> oh is this morgana's mom Ah, another shitty parent in this game. I forgot about Morgana's mom. That literally stole her off for money. Wow. Why must you hand out your miracles for nothing? Yep. I know that voice. Looking up at someone. A woman. She's draped in a black fog. I guess this is Morgana? Or from Morgana's perspective? And I can't make out any many details. But even through the darkness, I know immediately who she is. She is mother. My. No. She is not my mother. She is. Why would you even ask such a question, mother? We're barely holding on as, as it is, my dear. It's not wrong to expect a little remuneration from our ser for our services. That's a fucking weird-ass word. Big words. Big words hurt brain. Don't do that to me. Listen, my small brain can't do, can't do this. But 
No, mother, it is wrong. Miracles are not to be bartered for. Uh, tell that to the Catholic Church. <laughs> Funny Catholic joke. I think Lou was not raised Catholic. My mother was, and, uh, oof. God the Father does not charge for his miracles. So why should we when I am only borrowing his power? Listen to me, Morgana. Every time you give someone a blessing, you're hurting yourself. If not for the miracle itself, you still deserve some degree of compensation for the pain. I know you're concerned for me, Mother. And I appreciate it very much. No, no, she just wants the money. She just wants the money for herself. But I'm happy with the way things are. She ain't. <laughs> I'm happy to be able to help others with my Heavenly Father's power. Power you won't have much longer, my dear, if we can't afford to keep ourselves fed. I'm a saint, aren't I? Yes, you're my sweet little saint. God will not forsake his saint. No matter how difficult it may get, he will always provide me a way to continue doing his work. And you're the mother of that saint, aren't you? It's a bit weird having played some Shin Megami Tensei games. <laughs> And then going back to this and being like, oh, God isn't, like, the final boss. <laughs> and, like, three different people and also wants to nuke everything. Maybe. Although, I mean, Noah... Noah happened. That's right. I conceived you untainted by the hands of a man. Uh-huh. Then you must respect his will as well, Mother. It must be our highest priority. You're right. I was wrong, my dear saint. Ah, this is the day before she gets sold off! Yay! What fun. Mother, mother, you agreed with me. You said I was right. So why are you taking money from that man? Mother. Mother looks over as strange men shove me into a carriage. The look in her eyes sends a chill down my spine. I see her lips moving. She doesn't actually say the words out loud. But I can make out every individual syllable. Haha, <laughs> there's so much th slaps the house in Fata Morgana. This this game can fit so much trauma in it. <laughs> because you're worthless to me. Ha ha ha. Fuck. Welcome, daughter of God. You'll be performing miracles for me now. And if you cooperate, I can guarantee you'll live more than comfortably. Didn't we already see this? I guess... Yep, yep, we know. Yep. <laughs> Miracles are not something to be performed for one single person's benefit. What? Oh. oh. I'm sorry, Jess. Are you okay? 
Sorry to hear that. That that's ah. Oh. Okay, I'm glad to hear that. Just oh my. That's rough. I'm sorry to hear that. You're always welcome here. And always. I'm your mom now. <laughs> I'm your new mom. Miracles are not magic or parlor tricks. They are a precious gift granted to me by my father in heaven. Using his power for personal gratification is a grave sin. I will do no such thing. I entreat you to think long and hard about your actions. <laughs> do away with such selfish desires and dedicate yourself to helping the people. You take it, all right. <laughs> power you have been given was bestowed upon you by the hand of God. It is not your power. He is merely allowing you to make use of it for a short time. Yeah. Pride is a sin. Please consider how you conduct yourself. You're an ignorant, insolent child, aren't you? I bought you. You are my property. You have no right to an opinion. That is not my opinion. That is the way of the world as God. Silence. You're not here to talk. You're here to perform miracles for me and my guests. As I've already told you, I will do no such thing. What you will or will not do is my decision, not yours. The Lord says with a sickening laugh, then grabs me by the hair and knocks me to the floor. I beg him to stop, but he isn't listening to a word I say. Ah, yay! Cheers, saints, blood, and good fortune to all. I stir vaguely out of, out of the crowd, gathered for the Lord's blood feast. I'm going to go refill my water. I haven't taken a break yet, so I should do that. I'm gonna, it shouldn't be too long, though. I'll be right back. I said break, but <laughs> I just I just can't stand to be a long, a, away from chat for too long. <laughs> Stare vaguely out at the crowd, gathered for the Lord's blood feast. Every time he has guests, he throws another party, and every time he slices another part of my arms or legs open. It isn't long before they're an unsightly web of crisscrossing scars. Aha! What the fuck? The Lord sometimes has trouble deciding where to cut. But not, out of any not out of any sense of sympathy for me. He simply thinks drawing blood from an untouched area of my body 
will make it more effective. The Lord strips me bare. Perhaps I'll use your stomach today, Saint. I should be able to get some nice, pure blood there. Stop this. Can you not comprehend that what you're doing is an affront to the Lord? I'm free to do what I wish with my property. Saint or not, you are no different than any of my slaves. The Lord is greatly displeased with your actions. Then use your miracle powers to deliver divine punishment on me. Go on. You can do that, can't you? Your soul will be punished. You may not see the effects now, but you will pay for your sins one day. Ha! <laughs> You're not as threatening as you think you are, buck naked girl. <laughs> Don't give me that look, girl. I have no interest in taking that from you. Well, that's small miracle. At least he's not a pedophile, I guess. Yay. <laughs> You'd be lucky to find anyone willing to lay with a girl covered in disgusting scars. Oh, uh-oh. <laughs> What's up, Jess? Oh dear. That's not a good way to start a sentence. <laughs> uh, what? I have not, but what? <laughs> yes, I, I know, Hunter. X, Hunter. Oh, I see Kevin understands. Oh, okay. Interesting. I did not know... Hmm. I hope it's not weird about it. I hope it doesn't, like, paint it as something good. I don't think so. I, I've... It, it, anyways. Stuff can be weird like that, unfortunately. It sucks. Oh. Hmm. That's weird. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know. I don't know why people do that. I don't know why they do that. they wanted to make him more reviled i don't know it, i feel like there's better ways anyways i hope they don't portray it as a good thing that's all i'm gonna say wait and endure day after day of torture and shame of the Lord searching new for new places to stick his knife. I'll watch it eventually.
<laughs> Just end stream, watch it now. <laughs> oh yeah, sure. Yeah, whatever. Yeah, definitely. Now let me just, uh, yeah, all right. Goodbye, everybody. No, I'm <laughs> My entire body except for my face is covered in reddish black wounds. Aha, well, d more trauma for the child. So much drama. Trauma. I guess there's drama too, but... Someone, anyone, help me. Get me out of here. Please, someone. Oh, Father who art in heaven, I pray for you to lead me unto deliverance. Father, their trials, they are much too great. I guess they just had to remind us that that happened. Like, yay, thanks for that. <laughs> Morgana. The funny cat from Persona 5? All I know is that everyone hates that cat because it tells them to go to bed. I've never played Persona 5. I don't- I've never played a Persona game. I've only played the Shin Megami Tensei series. And the spin- some spin-offs of that. Oh, how is- how is, uh, Evangelion? How's that going? Oh, okay, cool. <laughs> oh, okay. I feel like Evangelion is a- is a- is a- It's a show you don't- I feel like as you watch it, you don't like it. You just, you just suffer. <laughs> uh, it's like, wow, this sucks. A lot of shit is happening, huh? Uh, but I mean, it, it, I, it, there's, I know, of course, there's a reason it's so popular and spawned such a franchise. It's obviously very good, so, assumedly. I need to watch that too. There's there's too much stuff I need to watch. Oh, there's always too much stuff. Too much stuff, not enough time. Oh, okay. Well, I I I I hear that they like. I think they like ran out of budget or something for like the last two episodes. So the the animation in the last two episodes is like really interesting it's like really abstract i think or something like that and i know that the um well i don't want to i don't want to I, I know a little bit about the anime but hearing that the animation is good is surprising actually because yeah it's pretty old this is not a It is not a new anime, that's for sure. <laughs> that was much clearer than the first time I saw it. 19... That is... Bef yep, that's also before I was born. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Wow, 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 wow. 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 Everything she felt... Her struggling, her sincerity, her pain, and her voice it felt almost as though I was the one going through it all. Uh, the Lord can understand why Morgana would bear such a powerful grudge against him, considering everything he did to her. Why would he do that, though? Is there some reason, some explanation for his actions 
No, don't. Oh, eh. I'm thoroughly exhausted. Like I've just spent the last several months having my blood drained again and again. To be fair, you 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 did get stabbed in the shoulder, and you know you probably did lose quite a lot of blood. So it is, you know, not surprising. feel like they have boulders tied to them. Just trying to get to my feet makes me dizzy. It's so cold. <sighs> She's probably waiting for me by now. I should get going. I have to do this. Move. Damn it. Fighting against my body's attempts to succumb to gravity with every step through sheer force of will. Oh, this poor guy. I make my way to the courtyard. Well, hey, we get to see Maria again and her... That. Her... Clothing. And lack thereof. certainly an outfit it is it is a queen outfit <laughs> you're so right captions you're so right oh welcome in uh noel yeah 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 yep yep i've actually played this before i'm replaying it but yeah this part the uh the weird Back in time shenanigans. Yeah, yeah, it's uh I've already cried multiple times. <laughs> cried, not tried. There you go. It's it still gets me. Oh man, but how are you doing? Uh what do you want me to call you by the way? Uh Noel or Noel? Yeah, it's oh man. <laughs> Oh, it hurts. Oh, that, that part where, um... Giselle, you know... Finally breaks through and, and, and embraces Michael and tells him that, you know, she loves him no matter what. That, uh oh, that... Oh, I think I cried for like a half hour on stream for that. Oh, man. That part hurt. Uh, top three of the animes. Oh. Oh. Yeah, oh. <laughs> oh. Yeah, it's a... Uh, it's, it's, a, it's a story that I think everybody can have like a bit of... You know connection to hopefully not too much connection though are you all right noel <laughs> too much connection god i'm not that horny stop it captions yeah hopefully not too much connection to his story because oh man uh michael goes through it but yeah top three anime um I, I'm really bad at watching. It's been a while since I've watched anime. I watched Madoka Magica. That one's really good. That one I like a lot. That's that's probably in the top three. Um, Clanad. It's been ages since I watched that, but that one's good. Yeah, they really did a good job with it. They really... Um, yeah. Oh, so true, Buttspot. So true. I actually rewatched it with it um, with a friend and my sister who had not watched it before. So that was a very fun experience. Um, we had to make sure that she stayed. T uh, <laughs> we, we watched it all in one sitting because uh, because we could. And also because uh, my sister doesn't like, you know, not necessarily like bad endings, but it's like just when it's such a depressing ending. But uh, Madoka manages to subvert that. 
really well, I think. So I think Madoka might be my favorite. Um, a weird comfort one for me is like... Uh, Key the Metal Idol? Oh, I, I haven't even watched Rebellion. I need to watch Rebellion. I still need to watch that. Maybe we'll do that. Maybe I'll do that with um, with my friend. But yeah, Key the Metal Idol is... Um, it's a really weird old anime. Um, but it's one of the... It, like, kind of, sort of inspired, like... Evangelion, I think, is what it said. Somewhat. It's about a girl who... Um, she thinks she's a robot and she acts like she's like really emotionless um and she's told by her dad before he dies that she needs to get what is it like 10,000 30,000 friends I think um to become a real girl so she needs to so she decides to become an idol and uh it's very weird <laughs> It's a very weird anime, but I very I like it a lot. Um, that's probably like my third. I guess Clonad would be my second then. But yeah, there's there's plenty of anime I need to watch. But yeah, Madoka is so good. I've read uh I've read like all the well not all of the different manga, but a lot of them. Um, they're just as wild. Oh man. But yeah, Madoka, Madoka is so, is a, there's a reason they call it, uh, miserable lesbians. <laughs> I, I find it so funny that it, it got voted as the top, uh, Yuri anime, uh, in like a Japanese poll, uh, above an actual, like, Yuri anime, <laughs> cause it's not, it's not like technically explicitly yuri but you know you know there's a lot there's a lot that happens in that anime that that can't really be explained heterosexually but yeah we are we are here we have just talked with yuki masa and uh got his side of the story and now we're with maria and her Clothes? Kind of. There's something. There's, there's something there. So so don't ban me, Twitch. You cannot see an entire titty. Which, you know... Unfortunate, but also good. <laughs> don't want to be banned. Please, Twitch. Please do not ban me forget what the uh the maria voice was oh my god oh it's pauline that i always have such trouble getting the voice there you are thank god you came sneaking onto church grounds is a bit unnerving so if you uh, are you all right no <laughs> we are not all right you look like you just came back from the dead yeah pretty much I'm fine. Michael, you are not. <laughs> Michael, buddy, you 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 have you've gone through a lot. Thank you for coming. Now, to continue our conversation from yesterday. Oh, whoa, 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 slow down. Who do you think you're convincing? You look about as fine as a fucking corpse. But if you are interested, Noel, I am playing another visual novel blind, actually. Oh, that's... Well, the specific reason I do that is um, that way my captions differentiate it. But uh, I am playing Yumi Neko blind. Um, Yumi Neko. It, it never gets it. The captions never get that. But yeah we are we are in the we're still in chapter one because oh my god that game is huge yep yep oh i've heard so many good things about it i we've we've gotten past the you know we've gotten to the murders six are dead dun, dun, dun.
dun. And boy. Yeah, I've, I've heard so many good things about Yumi Neko. It's very good, yeah. Okay, cool. I appreciate that. Thank you. I very much appreciate that. Yeah, I, I, I like playing visual novels, but I also play, like, RPGs and just just weird-ass games <laughs> in general. Uh, it depends on them, you know. But yeah, I appreciate it. Thank you, Noelle. I ha- well, I watched the anime, and then I read the manga, and I have, um, three of the question arcs, I think, but I've, I've read, I've watched and read it, so I, I know it, but I've never read, like, the visual novel, and not the original, I never read the original, but yeah, Higurashi is, whew, that's a wild ride. And I haven't seen the new... I keep hearing conflicting things about the new Higurashi anime. Yeah. Yeah. It, you know, it's kind of... It, it is a bit old. But yeah. No, I've... I've I, I probably know most of it. <laughs> but it's... Yeah. I might... Maybe I'll read it at some point. But, uh... There are so many different pieces of it on, on Steam that it's like... It's not like Yumi Neko where I can just get all the question arcs and get all the... Oh, okay. Oh, uh, I didn't know it had Yumi Neko ties in it. Tie-ins, interesting. Yeah, I have like the first three question arcs. I think I'd started reading them with my sister uh, just before I streamed. So just reading them along with my sister, which was fun. I think we got through the first question arc, which, uh, boy, Keiichi has a rough time in that one. Woo! I mean, to be fair, I don't think Keiichi has a good time in any of them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, okay, fair enough. I think I might know which two characters you're explain. You think you're you're um saying, but I don't want to. I don't want to. What's the word I'm looking for? contemplate that and like accidentally spoil anything but yeah we've played what other visual novels we've played we know the devil that was a really good one um have I, what other visual novels have i played God, i can't remember i always foregore <laughs> But yeah, thank you. I appreciate it. And we had, we, um, oh, We Don't Know the Devil was fantastic. It was really good. Um, I've been meaning to play the, not necessarily sequel, but it's like in the same universe, I guess. Um, yeah, We Know the Devil is really good. Uh, t -t -t What other I don't I, yeah it's very good it's it's really good I I had a lot of fun with that one um also if it's yeah that would probably be a good idea because my 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 brain cannot remember uh all the games I have finished and I mean there's I've played plenty of visual novels off stream or like before I even started streaming, like Steins Gate and uh, Chaos Child, and I watched a playthrough of Chaos Head and the Zero Escape series and I the Somnium Files, which I am once I am so excited if I once I finally get my new PC, I will hopefully be able to stream that and uh, force everyone to suffer through Date being horny. Yep, exact. Thank you. <laughs> I appreciate it. Yeah, uh, I have not played the sequel like at all, and it's killing me. Cause I, uh, I have a Simon Files like my favorite game. It's just so the Found Family is so good. Um. Uh, 
We had a full boyfriend. That was fun. But I never played that on stream. Where there's... Who knows if I played on stream? What would you even classify Bad End Theater as? What was that? That, that was... What do you even put that as? Um... But yeah, thank you. Yeah, I... I... Yeah, Bad End Theater was a lot of fun. Um, it's like a weird... I don't know exactly how to describe it. <laughs> yeah, I, I have played Amori. Oh, man. Whew. Yeah. I will say I, I liked Amori, but I didn't really like the... Um... I didn't like the real world sections as much, but the the story of Amori is whew, oy oy oy. That's a it is a doozy, that's for sure. Let's see, I guess Paradise Killer is kind of a well. It's that's more of a well. Paradise Killer is a weird game to try to categorize. Adventure game, I guess? God. That game was good, but man, trying to... Oh, yeah. Oh, Ever17. Um, Ever17 is uh, such a good game, but oh my god. Getting through the... The, the ham sandwiches. The ham sandwiches. Uh, so many ham sandwiches. Yeah, oh my god. Yeah, uh, 999 was actually the first... Or, uh, yeah, the sandwiches are so bad. 999 was the first visual novel I played. Um, I got it when I was 18, because I really wanted... Because I heard about it, and I was like, Oh, this seems... Like, I heard, and I was like, I want to try... Like, when I was turning 18, I was like, I want to try, like, an M-rated DS game. And I was like, well, there's not many of them. Yeah, I I hear I hear good things about Remember Eleven. Um, I hear that the ending's like a little weird, but I hear it's really good. I hear Never Seven is like bad. <laughs> oh yeah, nine 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 on the DS is a trip. I'm glad they they put it on PC, but you know there's a little bit of you know the uniqueness that's lost unfortunately, but it is what it is. We played Inscription recently. That's not a visual. Well, that's just that's not a visual novel. But that game was that game was really good. My poor brain. Oh god, Uchi's most unhinged. I. How can you get more unhinged than Date and Sigma? Yeah, Inscription was really good. It was a lot of fun. Um... It, it definitely took a turn I didn't expect, but I should have expected based on the the uh, creators. Well, I don't want to I don't want to say anything, but it's really good. I'd I'd recommend it. Oh dear. And that's that's from that's from Uchi Koshi. I apologize, uh, uh, but to everyone who's not quite understanding, Zero Escape is a very. How do you even describe Zero Escape? It's like if uh, somebody watched Saw, and then but also had um, like the random uh, like the button to hit a random page for Wikipedia, uh, and they were just clicking it every once in a while, and then info dumping to you about what they were reading <laughs> with anime characters. It's. It's a wild ride. But yeah, Inscription is a... Let's see, the, the creator made... I, I saw it on Twitter, somebody described it as that. I, I can't take credit for that. Um, but the creator made, what was it? He made Pony Island, and then he also made The Hex, which I haven't, I never heard of before, but I had heard of Pony Island before. But yeah, it's... Uh... And then I the Somnium Files. How do you even describe that? You're a 
Oh, you almost did? Yeah, that's fair. I... It's... I feel like, um... Like, how... Even though I love, love, uh, 999, I have not, like, ever brought myself to replaying it. I think that's just because it, it can be a little tedious. Especially the DS version. Oh, I've heard about Root Double. A uh, Root uh, Double. Oh, it is by Uchi? I didn't know. I thought it was like, um... I have to check that out. And thank you, Buttspot. Yeah, the Zero Escape series is... It's so fucking wild. Uh, and then there's Zero Time Dilemma. Oh, Zero Time Dilemma. You tried. We appreciate it. I do wish we could have seen, like... Oh, Scenario Writer. Interesting. I wish we could have had ZTD with, um... With the animation, like, budget of... <laughs> I, the Sound and Files. Exactly. It... I mean, that, to be fair, that game almost didn't happen, so... You know, the fact that we got any game and we got we got carlos we got we got a ot3 c team so that's worth anything honestly freaking carlos trying to undivorce junpei and and uh akane yeah oh my god i actually didn't get in on that i i think because i think it was a while until i played I think I played like Z, uh, like VLR, like a year or two before, like it came out. Cause oh my god, but yeah, Project Bluebird was I. That was something I. I was like, oh my god, that thing was wild. Didn't uh, didn't Uchikoshi recently accidentally like or not accidentally he like confirmed that there's gonna be an I the Somnium Files 3 or whatever <laughs> cause he he was like talking up he was like commented on um something Jackie Lastra said oh it did interesting I guess maybe because of like um maybe because it doesn't have quite the anime you know style that is good yeah anything to to bring Zero Escape more into the light Yeah, yeah, um, I think, like, Uchi commented on, um, uh, like, I think Jackie Lastra said that she was, like, playing I, the Summoning Files 2, and she was like, this was great, and, uh, Uchi was like, yeah, I'm so glad you liked it, I can't wait to bring you back for the third game, and it's like, what? <laughs> it was something like that. But yeah, I am glad that more people are, you know... Because it's definitely a game worth... Yeah, Uchi... Hold on, I'm, I'm gonna actually try to find the uh, specific thing, because... <sighs> Uchi Koshi... I, I am still glad we have the first democratically uh, elected gay character <laughs> uh, in a video game. So glad for that. Listen, the, the Zero Escape fandom is fucking wild. I love it so much. Uh, let's see. Oh. I also remember that Uchikoshi got recently a accused of being a, a California girl because they thought that... Uh, I thought he was like tricking everybody. Akuma Drive, Aku, uh, uh, Akudama Drive. I have not. Interesting. I also haven't like I haven't checked out everything that uh, Uchi has done. Like there's um Punchline. Let's see where where is it? Where is? Talking about oh no oh god there's ah 
I decided to check uh, Uchi's spoiler, uh, Uchi's, Uchi's Twitter, and surprise, there's spoilers. Um, give me a second. Okay, here it is. Yeah. Let me read the tweet. We finished uh, Nirvana Initiative last night. Oh boy, what a roller coaster. Chikoshi never been able to draw out every emotion. Love this game. Could not recommend it more. VAs kill it, the, killed it. The story was incredible. I'm so sad it's over. Then Uchi Koshi replies, Thank you so much. Really had a lot of fun watching some of your charming streaming video. I feel like I got a great idea about Iris for the third. <laughs> Just looking forward to hearing your lovely voice and wonderful, wonderful performance again next time. He just, <laughs> just randomly. Oh my god. I can't. <laughs> oh my god. Apparently, apparently, Uchi Koshi liked it. This, this is not. I'm just seeing this now. Uchi Koshi liked a tweet about Iris being, uh,. AI 3's protagonist. <laughs> I, I don't doubt it. Oh my god. I don't doubt it at all. He would be. Yep. Uh, it's gonna be... Remember the freaking... So, I think I talked about this when it was happening, but the freaking ARG that went along with... um. I, the Somnium Files Nirvana Initiative, was very weird. Yeah. Poor Iris. Um, and it, like, had its, like, hoochie coochie. <laughs> Thank you, captions. Yes, exactly. I'm sure that's what he would love. Yeah. Yeah, I, I remember f I followed, uh, I didn't, I didn't follow along with the, um, the first ARG for the first game, which I'm a bit sad about because I still can't believe that they went to the Somnium Files Discord and Oda had a fucking existential crisis. But um, for the second game, they had it like have like characters in the sequel get like kidnapped, and then you had to like balance like retweets or something to make to like save them both. And freaking Iris got killed or something, or got like Iris lost. <laughs> oh, it was so weird. But yeah, yeah, oh my god. Rip. I mean to to be fair, it, it was it was interesting to see what they would go with. You know, you love to see it. Oh, poor Iris. But yeah, the... Just the Uchikoshi... Uchikoshi is just wild. He's on Twitter for so much. Like... Being able to freaking just... And he just brings up the most random shit. Like he, he decided to tell us that um, the protagonist of Virtue's Last Reward has a uh, an eighteen inch penis that can fold up into a sigma shape because his name is Sigma. I, this is not the lore we wanted confirmed. Uchi Koshi, please. Yeah, his uh, his baguette, as as Uchi has been fond of saying, his his baguette. Oh my god, dude! What a what a! I honestly can't believe it. It's it's too much. I mean, to be fair, if I made a game, that's probably how I would react. Uh, with like that's how I would interact with people on Twitter about it too <laughs> I 
Listen, just cause like you don't. <laughs> I would. I. It's just so. Apparently, also his daughter is into um, BTS, which is. I wonder if they're gonna have some impact. <laughs> I wonder if they're. I wonder if that's gonna influence any of his games. Uh, his pin tweet is the is the Mizuki thumbs up image. I love that. Oh my god. I just have to. I. It sucks. I can't. I can't watch, I can't look at his um, Twitter too much because I, I don't want to spoil, uh, I don't want to spoil the second game for me, which I somehow have managed to avoid despite it being out for months. So I'm going to keep dodging them, the spoilers like I'm in the Matrix. But yeah, that meme is so good. Such a stupid meme, I love it. But yeah, if anyone is interested in... <laughs> I hope this sparks somebody's interest in, uh... In Zero Escape or Uchikoshi in general, because the man is unhinged. Did he just, like... So he, he's like the most unhinged for Remember 11. Did he just like not have like as many, I guess people just like making sure he, no, you're fine. <laughs> it's very understandable. Listen, I, I, chat can confirm that I, I will go off on tangents for anything. Like I've, I've gone on, on several tangents about Live Alive and that remake so many times I did it before the remake was announced because that was that was the first game I actually streamed kind of and it was replaying it but god that game but yeah I know that um oh yeah yeah the, re the remake is really good it it sucks that Square is being such an asshole about it so if you don't know what Square Enix has been doing recently Probably for the best. Uh, they've gotten into NFTs. They... <sighs> they're just shitty. And for the Live Alive remake, they have... Um, been copy striking any... Like, videos that had that show, like, the endgame portion of it. Or, like, spoilers for it. And they're copy striking music for the game. And it's just... Like, I, I I, guess, like, they don't want to spoil the new stuff that they added, because they did add a little bit of new stuff, but why? Why are they so shitty about it? It fucking sucks. Like, it's just... I don't understand. Like, all you're doing is making it more difficult for people to get into it, like... Like, you're, you're really blocking spoilers for a, a game that's almost 30 years old? Really? Like, I, get, I know they changed, like, a little bit. They added some, a little bit of stuff, but that is not... That does not require them to go and, like... Like, um... If anybody watches Vine Sauce here, um, Vinny has, uh... Has been struggling with them freaking taking down they took down like two of his videos for that two of his like live alive videos because uh can't have any spoilers of a 30 year old game i just it's uh, it's so shitty and it sucks because i really like their games vsauce here how shitty vsauce michael here Fuck you, Square Enix. Like, I want to like, like, Octopath Traveler. I, I want to play that. I want to play the new, 
Um, I played the... <laughs> Yeah, I can I can do it a little bit, I guess. I haven't watched too many Vsauce vo uh, videos, so I can't do it perfectly. But but I I actually played um yeah I played what was it Voice of Cards? That was a lot of fun, and they're making a third game for that. But it's just it's just why. It's like, I guess it's kind of similar to with like, I don't know, it's all, it's like, you know, big companies, it always feels shitty to endorse them. Yeah, Voice of Cards was a lot of fun. Um, and that's by the people, that's by the same person that wrote Near Automata, I believe, which I also need to play. I got it on sale for like 15 bucks, but my current PC cannot run it, so... I, it's very sad. Yeah, it was a lot of fun. Um, I hear that people didn't like the sequel as much. Like, it's got mixed reviews. But I do want to try it at some point. Probably when it's when it goes on sale sometime. That'll probably happen whenever they release the third one. Yeah, Automata is... I know a little bit about it. I mean, I know, of course, how many people want to fuck 2B, but that's just how it is. But I, it's such a good game what, from what I've heard. And if I get a new PC, maybe I can actually finally stream it. Because, oh my god, this PC cannot stream Stardew Valley. <laughs> this PC cannot stream that at all. It, uh, well, it, it tried. And then, and, then the, uh, and then the villagers woke up. And then... Yeah. I actually had been playing Bravely Default too, because I, I actually really loved the... Um, that actually got me back into RPG, JRPGs was um, Bravely Default. Which is funny, because I played the, uh, the for the sequel version, and I would not have loved it as much if I had played the original. Because <laughs> the, 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 the re... The not remake, but like remaster fixes a lot of the issues that the original had. But I had been playing um, Bravely Default too, but I just it just it just chugged, and I just I just felt bad, and I I don't want it. I I feel bad, and I don't know. I want it to be at least decent. Yeah, the Bravely series is really good. Um, <laughs> yes, thank you, Buttspot. Um, definitely play if you're gonna you know obviously start with bravely default or you can honestly go with bravely default too i don't think that really it's weird because you know even though it's it's the it's two it's it's not like directly connected with the other two which i say other two because it, there's bravely default and then there's bravely second and then there's bravely default too which is but yeah um I definitely recommend the... Bless me. The... For the sequel version of uh, Bravely Default. Because that one fixes a lot of, like... I think there's, like, portions where... Yeah! Bravely Second is... Is the second game. Um, that one got a lot more mixed. But I, I enjoyed it. I actually really enjoyed it. Um, uh, I think I enjoyed Bravely Default, the first one more, but Bravely De Bravely Second was good. It was a good continuation of the story. That's what Second is. It's like a, it kind of starts where uh, Default left off, and then Bravely Default Two is like entirely unrelated, <laughs> like no, different protagonists entirely, maybe different world i don't know or like d different part of the world at least it seems like an entirely different world it's really weird but i, I like it um yeah but i mean if you uh if you have a 3ds and uh you have some time uh i'm sure there's plenty of ways you could uh you know get bravely default without you know, supporting Square, if you get what I'm saying. 
Ahem. Anyways. Which is funny, I actually bought both Bravely Default and uh, Bravely Second. And, uh, you know, Bravely Default too. But I think that was before they... I, I, they did the, you know, shitty NFT stuff and the stuff with the Live Alive remake, which... God... It sucks, because it... They, it, well, it seemed like they, like, really, like wanted it to be a really good remake because they they brought back the or they had the guy who originally made the game they brought uh yoko shimamura to do the soundtrack again because she did the first soundtrack for the game which oh my god it's such a bop um it's just there's so much like polish you can tell that like there was so much care put into the remake and then and then square goes and does this shit and like no you can't yeah it's this it's the directors it's always the directors it's i hate it it's so shitty but honestly i would recommend like the remake 100 percent more than the original um there are like there's like a little bit of issues with the translation but not for the reason shitty twitter bros say so like there's like a portion where like in the original like the um the old kung fu master said something like smile it looks prettier on you or something in the japanese and they didn't put that into the english version which good but like people on twitter were mad about that for some reason I don't know. People on Twitter are mad about everything. But yeah, the Live Alive remake is very, very good. I I think it's worth... I, how much is it? It's probably like 60 bucks. I think it's worth it. Yeah, yeah. Twitter is shitty. But yeah, thank you. Yeah. I appreciate you, Kev. Sorry we didn't do much actual streaming of the game. I kind of just derailed into chatting mostly. But it was fun. It was good. I, I needed to... And it was fun. Uh, I don't know if I'm going to stream too much longer. Because uh, I need to eat dinner at some point. I just want to save that just to make sure. But yeah, Twitter is a cesspool. But yeah, take, rest, have, a, have a good rest of your... Uh, uh, rest of your night. And I might... Uh, I might stream tomorrow. Um, because... I won't be able to I won't be able to stream on Saturday yeah yeah I appreciate it uh, we actually have a discord if you want to join it um, there's not too much going on there but if you want to stop by there and then I have um, let me just plug my wait is that the wrong thing it's somewhere I you, you, the, the, this should bring up YouTube there's my YouTube VOD channel. I don't know why the Discord didn't work. Fuck me, I guess. But I do have a Discord if you want to join that. But yeah. There you go. Thank you, Kev. Oh my god. Uh, thank you. I appreciate it. Yeah. Um, we chat some. We don't like chat all the time in there. It's mostly just like. Um, has like. Just like for announcements for when I go live. Because I don't usually like do anything on a... I have a Twitter, but I don't really use it too much. <laughs> Wait, oh, it's expired? <sighs> I thought... I don't know why it's always... <sighs> it's so annoying. I don't know. Do I have to... I thought I made it so it didn't expire, but I guess I failed. Um, weird. Thank you, Kev. <laughs> See, oh, yeah, yeah. But yeah, um, I tend to try to stream at like afternoons, uh, CST, and then on like Sunday, I try to stream earlier so that like people who thank you yay you made it Woo! 
But yeah, so like people in different time zones. I'll try to, yeah. Uh, why is it like that? It's so weird. But yeah, um, what was I saying? So yeah, I tend to stream like Monday, Wednesday, Thursday. I, I'm thinking I'm going to start streaming on Fridays because I can't really stream on Saturdays anymore. Um, and then Sunday. But yeah, I appreciate it. Yeah. Yeah, and, and please feel free to like uh, recommend games or anything because, well, I mean, I, there's always games I want to play, but I always love about hearing about new more uh, new games. What was I trying to say there? And uh, I'm gonna try to find somebody for us to raid because I think I'm gonna. Ooh, ah. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, geez. And if you have a, if anybody has a raid recommendation, please feel free to let me know. Sorry, we've just had uh, Big Titty Maria uh, up on the screen for the past hour. <laughs> oh, an RPG Maker VN. Okay, sure. Yeah, uh, let me just make sure there's not like somebody I like that's like doing like a birthday thing or something that I know or something, but yeah. Da -da. Yeah, we 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 love Maria's bobbies here. Yeah, I'm not seeing anything, so feel free, feel free to uh. Do, 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 do. Do, do, do. Do, do, do. But yeah, feel free to to drop it in chat if you wanna. Uh. So many people playing League of Legends. Terrible. Oh, oh, Raccoon. That's made by the, um, that's made by, what's her name? She did music for, um, To the Moon. What is her name? I can't think of it. Brain. Verb. Yeah, Kangao. No, Kangao was the other person. Um, this was like the the singer. Uh, did I misspell it? Hold on, give me a sec. Oh, she's got a cute model. Or is that like a... Oh, that is cute. Oh, it's it's just a... That's still cute. It's uh, uh, Laura Shigahara, I think, is her name. I think. I know she has like her own YouTube channel and she does like other music as well. Like other like singing stuff. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, that's what it was. Yeah. That's a game I actually tried to play as well. Um, replay. I haven't played the sequels to the to the moon, though. Which is what I was trying to do. <laughs> I wanted to replay to the moon. Uh, oh. <laughs> Hold on. <laughs> they only allow in-network raids. What does that mean? Well, uh, I'm going to follow them... I have hit my follower limit. <sighs> Did you know there's a limit to how many people you can follow on Twitch? I do. I've hit it. <laughs> is it like, do I have to be following them to raid? Or what does in-network raids mean? I have no idea what that means. Yeah, I, don't, I didn't know either. I, that's the first time I've gotten that uh, message. <laughs> Oh, 
I mean, we could just, like, uh, semi-raid and just, like, like, you posted the Twitch, the, uh, Twitch in chat, so everybody just, uh, go click on that. <laughs> we can just do it that way. Yeah, I had no idea either. I don't know, Twitch is weird. Twitch be, Twitch be funky. Oh yeah, I mean, I'm open to whatever, but I've actually... Ooh, yeah, Twitch is always weird. Twitch stinky. Twitch stinky. Okay, I'm down for Elden Ring. I've actually never played a uh, Dark Souls game. Oh boy. Scenario, I think I actually might already follow them. <laughs> I was like going through like I gotta unfollow somebody so I can quickly follow. Let's see, I think I do. Um... Yeah, yeah. I've played. Yeah, let me see. I think I am following them. Yeah, I am. I am. Okay, cool. Yeah. I think like the closest I played was. Um... What is that? Ninja Gaiden Black for the uh, Xbox. And I never beat that, but oh my god, that game was... <laughs> that game... That game was pain. Yeah, yeah. Well, to be fair, I am as well. <laughs> but yeah, let's raid on into Sonari. Uh, and I did give... Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And also feel free to, of course, give, uh, give Verbena, uh, Magia a raid, uh, follow as well. But yeah, thank you everybody for coming. I really appreciate it. Um, I know this stream ended up being more talking than game, but I think that's quite all right. It was a lot of fun. And, uh, we did get somewhere. We got, we got, uh, we finished up his story and, or not his story. We finished up the swordsman stories and we learned a bit more. Yeah, yeah. So, uh, I will probably stream tomorrow. I might do... Might be Tales of Symphonia. Because, uh, I want to see more about those human farms. Anyways, bye! <laughs> Thank you everybody for coming. I really appreciate it. And yeah, take care everyone. Have a good uh, night rest of your day yeah i've been i just started it it's a wild ride yeah anyways i i, I could talk it more i could talk too much <laughs> but yeah let's raid on in uh bye bye yeah see you guys next time love you guys <laughs> <laughs>